tell me that the doors, the front is the original doors. Man, after at nine o'clock. Okay. But look, the bathrooms. You see the sign there around that way. Here we are at the San Xavier Mission. There's a little service going on for kids before they go to school, so we're gonna go and have a little look around at nine o'clock. Very cool. And then we're heading down to Tombstone on this lovely Tuesday morning. A lot of restoration work going on at the moment. It's all rather nice. And we've got cactuses as well, because we like cactuses. And a sacred mound, which overlooks the mission over there. It's really quite gorgeous and peaceful. Nice views of the surrounding area. Tucson. So from the mound here, look down, and there's the mission. Here we are, Boot Hill Graveyard. The famous Boot Hill Graveyard. Just outside Tucson. Oh my gosh. Yes. <laughs> Here lies Doris Johnson, hanged by mistake. He was right, we was wrong, we strung him up and now he's gone. The story I heard is that he was wanted for, I believe it was horse death. And he got evidence, you know, to show his innocence. And he rode into town to show it to everybody. I don't remember if he forgot his evidence or didn't get it to him fast enough, but they didn't have to hang it. As you look around, you can see the gunfighters, just as they stood on October 26th, 1881. Actually, that's a bit tacky, but good fun. Wyatt Earp and his You're ready? Yeah. 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 A couple of things before we get started, folks. First things first. I want you to give a message to your friend Holiday. I don't have time. You tell him he's going to stay cut. Fuck, I'm an officer. I don't want to hear this kind of talk. Yeah. How about you, Wyatt? Wait, you like they're gunning for you. Looks to me like you could use all the friends you could get. And find those cowboys just fine, dog. And not far from here. They're an empty lot on the OK Corral on Fremont. They look to me business and boys have got guns. Then we will take those guns away from them. Yeah! <laughs> He's 17. Hold up your hands, boys. We're here for your guns. Your guns. Oh, I don't want that! will say 30 shots in 30 seconds, but I wasn't counting and neither was you. Two months after this gunfight, Virgil Earp was ambushed outside the Crystal Palace Saloon. Three shotguns went off, but he still refused to die. Crippled up pretty bad, Virgil wandered the west till death found him in Nevada in 1905. Not as lucky was Wyatt's brother Morgan, shot in the back and killed, playing a game of pool up on Allen Street. Morgan died at midnight, March 19, 1882, his brother Wyatt's birthday. Now in 1887, the year this whole town began to fall apart, the two main causes of this gunfight died, hundreds of miles apart from each other. Actually, that was a really good gunfight, actually, good fun. Very good fun. Tombstone. Cool, we're going to watch a quick film and then go in and have a wander up to the Bocage Theatre. Tombstone. The town. Too tough to die. Okay, man. Right. 
target practice. We'll notice this is real life. She's quite good at this. Oh. So apparently I've got one more shot left. So <laughs> Look at the stance on his face. <laughs> Here's a birdcage theatre. Allegedly a very paranormally active area. Over here on the frame on the human fly shoe built out of foot up from the bottom corner. And that's a ricochet mark from a 45. Chair bills are the original chair bills for the final performance in 1889. This is the old uh, opera house. Come on to Fremont Street. I'll show you where the old. Ah, of course. Chevelin Hall. Okay, it's a bit windy here. I'll take you down to where the gunfight at the OK Corral really happened. It was actually just outside the place where they do the reenactment. So, the gunfight actually happened here. It was actually Hollywood that uh, associated the OK Corral with the gunfight. It actually just took place away from the, gun, from the uh, corral. And it's actually here. This is where the gunfight took place. There's this. spot the Earp and Clanton factions met on October 26, 1881 to settle the West's most famous feud. Yeah, there you go. Tombstone. We've been in you. It's been fun. So, uh, moving on for Grand Canyon tomorrow.